What's up, guys? Back up in here with another one. Next one in line off the album Circles from Mac Miller. This one's called That's On Me. I'm not going to lie. I saw the title and I thought of that little kid. Remember, he was, he stood up to his mom in the restaurant about the girl. He's like, that's on life. That's on life, mama. <laughs> that, that video always makes me laugh. If you know what I'm talking about, put it in the comments. But let's go ahead and check out what this song in this video was talking about. That's on me. some more it's like a kid rock type vibe that's what i get from it like you know kid rock has songs like this like his song with cheryl crow it, it's more country but laid back vibe i can't see a beat dropping in on this i might be mistaken but i like it for the cool vibe so far for sure and that hat don't trip that's super tight so i'm with it so far Damn, these lyrics are pretty much describing quarantine. Bouncing our heads off the wall. Seems like nobody knows where we're going for real. Man, it's like he was predicting the future because that's where we are. I feel like this is a song where I just got to sit back and listen to what he's saying. Listen to him get out what he's trying to get out. Is that a John Lennon tattoo on his arm? Leave that on the comments if I'm right or wrong. The one right there on his arm with the P for Pittsburgh. I just saw that because this gives me that kind of vibe too. Like almost imagine. I feel like there would have came a time in Mac Miller's career where he wouldn't have rapped at all. Like that was just his way to get in and to gain the attention. But now he's going to really show what he wants to do. Just like Tyler, the creator. And it was about to be fucking awesome. I just see where it was going and I'm like I say I'm with it. This really reminds me I need to listen to more rock and roll and more country because they have good stories. It's really just it's like anything else. It's just its own form. Like I like rap. I like storytelling and rap. I like the way they do things in that way. But I like storytelling in other forms, too, just like I like different types of movies, you know, so I need to keep my horizons expanding. Like I could be a hippie to this song. Like I could just sit up in a room and just 420 just Bob Marley it out and have this going on and be like, yo, play that back. I'd listen to it like three times. I could see that happening. Right. I said good morning. 
again this morning and I'll say goodnight Tell me how in the fuck was this not all over the radio? If it was, please correct me, put that in the comments, but I didn't hear it anywhere and I am shocked because this is a Post Malone level radio hit. How was this not a summertime hit? Let me know in the comments. Summertime fucking vibes. That's what I'm getting off this. Let me know if you feel the same way. If you if you would ride around with the top down, like sun setting, going to the beach or going anywhere, especially on like 4th of July, you know they're talking about something about we might not be able to have small gatherings, but fuck that. Everybody's going to do what they want to do. <laughs> Straight up. Last year was the most insane 4th of July when it was supposed to be locked down. Man, that shit was crazy. Tell me how it was in your town. Put that in the comments. That was one for the books. trying to make sure it was pretty much over but i dig that like i said chill vibe on a sunday fits the perfect mood probably give it a playback with something going on <laughs> you know some different aromas but thank y'all for definitely hanging out with me checking that out super cool you know always rest in peace to a legend to mac miller thank you for leaving us so many great things y'all make sure you like subscribe comment Hit the share, send it to somebody. Hit the notification bell so you know when we up in here. I got some more coming. We're almost through the album circles. Gonna look for some other things I haven't heard from from Mac. See about that. If you got anything you can suggest, definitely hit me up with that. I, I don't think I've heard much of like the Larry Fisherman stuff. So just let me know if there's anything I might not have heard that you want to see me react to. Somebody said the Divine Feminine. Most of that I've heard, pretty much all of it, but... If there's anything else, let me know. But I do have more coming. Thank y'all for subscribing, everybody that is. Everybody that hasn't, go ahead and subscribe. Join the fam today, for real. What are you waiting on? But for those of y'all that are new here, you got to watch me shut it down. For those of y'all that been here, you know what time it is. Peace.